The results of the Italian general election are threefold. Political gridlock, market jitters and a slap in the face for European austerity. The numbers mean that the country faces stalemate in the coming weeks as former foes put hostilities to bed in order to govern a country in difficulty. The poll has seen the political resurrection of Silvio Berlusconi, who's indicated that his centre-right group may be willing to enter into a grand coalition with Pierre Luigi Bersani. Bersani's centre-left bloc won 340 seats in the lower house, compared to Berlusconi's 124. But it's in the upper house or Senate where the problems reside, as any administration trusted to run the country will need a working majority in both houses to pass legislation. It's a limited disaster because something will happen. They, will, they have to. They, uh, President Napolitano and the people who have won or almost won, uh, they're going to have to come to some sort of deal. But it's going to be a very painful uh, few months, certainly until there is some sort of stability, assuming that that stability arrives.